Wow, it's crazy all the changes happening with timber trails. Yeah, did you hear? They're going to have an actual town with an actual mayor and everything. Huh. And the Lake Top Ridge is going to be a full-on resort, not just a lodge. And when Timber Trails becomes an actual town, it will be combined with another actual town. Oh, I heard about that. The town of Buffalo Chips. Yeah. Rumor has it that they wanted to join with us just so that they could change the name. Yeah, that's the rumor. Yeah, well, I know it's a bunch of change coming, but at least we got old Reliable. Good old trusty cabin. It's not going anywhere. Good old reliable trusty cabin. Yes. <laughs> DJ, do you smell that? Oh yeah. Smoke. I think it's coming from that billowing ash heap. Uh, no offense. Uh, none taken. Yeah. What is that? Wait. The, the cabin! cabin! <gasps> Oh no, the cabin! Oh, no. Yep, Are it's Gonzo. Are kidding oh, me? Oh no. Well, thank goodness no one was inside. Yeah, but do we know how this happened? Mm. Oh, well, mm. it seems like this mm. is the mystery. Uh, the mystery. Uh, well, Johnny, hmm? of is this a good time for that? Well, it's like my Uncle Meatrum says, never waste a good fire and it's always a good time for s'mores. The mystery of the fire. Well, oh. mystery, yes. Well, well, the fire department's going to tell us what happened soon enough, but I guess we could uh, try to solve it ourselves. Does anyone know what happened? Yes, yes. It all probably began yesterday when I was practicing my fire starting skills. All right, well, Cap said that I'd be more useful if I knew how to start a fire, so let's see. Step one, go outside. <laughs> Check. Step two, strike the flint with the knife. Oh. <laughs> I guess it's not gonna work. Uh, yeah, on second thought, that probably wasn't the best idea. No, no it wasn't. Yeah, but I don't think that's what burned the cabin down. Well, what do you think burned the cabin down, Ash? Well, you know, the cabin, it's starting to smell a little, and so I bought some candles, and well... Oh, okay, it has not been smelling good in here, and so now it will smell a lot better with these amazing scented candles. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. You cannot have too many candles. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Ooh. A little hot. This is gonna be good, oh my goodness. I cannot wait to have these lovely smells in here. I can smell it already. Alrighty, and just this last one. I think that should be good. Ah, oh, perfect. Now I'll go tell the guys. <laughs> Maybe I should have blown those out. Uh, yeah, that would have been a good Actually, idea. Actually, I don't think that's what started the fire either. Johnny, what do you know about the fire and how it started? Well... Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. I am so hungry. I cannot wait to cook this steak. It smells a little funny in here. Oh, it's got to be these candles. Oh, this awesome new vegan ribeye. I cannot wait to test it out. Just need to get this here lit. Whoop. Whoop. Alrighty, now to go get my vegan ribeye that somehow still came from a cow. <laughs> Can't wait. Um, how are we seeing all these flashbacks? Speechless. I am. I am just speechless. Look, I, I meant to save you part of the ribeye. It was just so tasty and vegan that I, I ate it all. Johnny, I wasn't talking about the steak. I was talking. Never mind. Never mind. I, I don't have words. But Cap, that couldn't have been how the fire started. Remember? 
What in the world is going on? <sighs> Burn the place down if I'm not around to put them out. Oh yeah. So how did the fire start? Oh, that explains uh, it. Yeah. Uh, oh, Lightning. Uh, hey, quick! Everyone to Elk Ridge Lodge for cover! Whew. That was close! Yeah, Cap, <sighs> what are we gonna do? Well, with all the changes, Cap, in the timber trails, I guess we'll just have to put in a request for a new mountain patrol lodge. Oh. Well, Captain. What if that one isn't as good? Yeah, or if it doesn't burn as nicely. Burn as nicely? Anyways, it's a good reminder for us that this world is not our home. You know, 2 Peter 3.13 tells us that we are waiting for the promise of a new heaven and a new earth. That's nice, but how does it help us right now? Well, you see, as people, we experience loss and change all the time in our lives. But as God's people, we experience change, but we're also looking for the ultimate city with foundations whose builder is God. And that will be unmovable. That does sound pretty nice. Indeed it does, Johnny. Well, my Uncle Thad is expecting me in town. He's going to run a few things by moi, so I'm going to head out. See you guys See ya, Johnny. Yep. Keep that safe. <gasps> Don't eat that. Do you think that Johnny is going to become a Christian before the end of the season? Season? Yeah, you know, spring. Oh, well, that season. I, uh, I sure hope so. Yeah. I can keep praying for him. That's a good idea. I know that God has Johnny, our cabin, and all the future endeavors in his hands. We just need to be waiting patiently on him and respond in worship to what he does. Ah, sounds, sounds good. good.